good quality planning, they say, is the key to productivity. But the best laid plans often don't quite turn out the way we want them to. Things have a habit of going astray. Welcome to this edition of Being Human, the science, art, and magic of what it takes to be a human being. We're going to look at something called the Cobra Effect, or the Law of Unintended Consequences. And we go back to the days of the British in the 19th century in Delhi, when the whole city was kind of infested with too many cobras. So in an attempt to control the problem, the British offered a bounty for each dead cobra that was brought in. Some smart guys saw a business opportunity here and they started raising cobras as some kind of farming so that they could take them in and collect the bounty. Well, the British soon got wise to it and the bounty was withdrawn. Once that happened, there wasn't any point in raising these cobras and keeping them at home and feeding them. So these guys just let them loose and they once again ran over the entire city. The problem was back again, much bigger than original. This is why we call these kind of uh, behaviors the cobra effect. In the digital age, when disruption and disruptive technologies are often spoken about, there are many dramatic examples of the cobra effect. Let's begin first with transportation. And we are all quite familiar, indeed, most of us can't live without Uber and Ola and their likes. They are a convenience, no doubt, but then what happens is more cars have hit the road, there is more congestion, and the problem that we were trying to solve has actually been worse. Airbnb, again, is a wonderful tool. I mean, I use it all the time, and it opens up avenues for travel that you never really had before, but Airbnb is great for owners and short-term answers, but what it does is it decreases the availability of rental properties, and it's not so good for long-term renters, and many cities and towns are actually worrying about this problem now. And of course, social media. What started initially as a really terrific way of staying in touch with friends and acquaintances all over the world has over time been hijacked by rather unscrupulous, evil-minded people who have used social media as a means of subverting and uh, altering political situations, bringing in political destabilization and even threatening democracy as we know it today. We're all familiar with the Cambridge Analytica scandal with Facebook, where a gigantic amount of uh, data was breached and used for manipulating people. Cobras fight, and when they do, you must remember their venom can sometimes be fatal. Life and the world that we live in is highly unpredictable despite our best laid plans. Things often go contrary to the way we want it. Thank you for being with me for this edition of Being Human.